In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to recreate this brown glittery smoky eye. This is a really pretty dramatic look that complements any eye color. I'm going to be using Urban Decay's Naked palette, as well as their Book of Shadows Volume 4 palette. If you don't own these palettes, don't worry, I'm going to list some dupes on my blog which you can visit by clicking the link below. Okay, let's get started. I've primed my entire eyelid and now I'm applying Naked from the Naked palette above my crease. This shadow is described as being a buff matte and the soft colour makes it perfect for applying in this area. Next I'm going to put Buck from the Naked palette in my crease. Using Naked and Buck will create a nice transition from the dark eyeshadows we'll be using on the main lid to the skin near your brow bone. Now I'm covering my mobile lid with black gel liner. You could also use a jumbo eyeliner pencil for this step. Now I'm covering the gel liner with a dark bronze brown shadow from Urban Decay's Book of Shadows Volume 4 palette called Lost. I'm also going to blend this into my crease as well. Next, I'm applying a sparkly taupe brown from the Book of Shadows Volume 4 palette called Midnight Rodeo. I'm focusing on putting this in the center of my mobile lid. This will give the lid more definition. To add a little more sparkle to this look, I'm covering this same center area with some champagne glitter from JCAT's Sparkling Cream palette. Here I'm adding more buck from the Naked palette to help blend the shadows I've used. Now I'm applying Lost from the Book of Shadows Volume 4 palette under my eye. This is the same shadow I used on my mobile lid earlier. Finally, I'm going to apply Virgin from the Naked palette on my brow bone and in the inner corner of my eye. Now I'm lining my top lash line with Urban Decay's 24-7 liquid liner in Perversion. I'm going to wing it out to the end of the area I covered in gel liner. I'm also using a small amount of this liner to line my lower lash line. I'm making sure to connect this to the wing I created before. Now I'm applying Urban Decay's pencil liner in zero to my lower waterline. 
Now it's time to curl my lashes. I like to press the curler in two or three different places. I start by holding it for a few seconds near the lash line, then I move out to about the middle of my lash and hold, and then I move out toward the end and hold it again. Now I'm applying some mascara. I'm using L'Oreal Voluminous False Fiber Lashes Mascara. I finish this look by applying some Salon Perfect False Lashes. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you want to see a full product list, you can visit my blog. The link will be below in the description.